Welcome back everybody, Danny here, thanks for joining in. Today's video is a little bit off topic, yes, but it's very exciting to me. I love when I run across stuff like this and I really wanted to share this with you. I have been gaming uh, in general, various different types of gaming, probably since the mid to late 80s, since I was a very young child. You're talking about Ataris, the original Nintendos, all the really old, old, old consoles. And graphics performance has clearly changed tremendously over the years. Uh, obviously, that's not a secret. Everybody knows that, especially since the days of Atari and Nintendo and things like that. But we've really made drastic jumps in performance, uh, graphics performance and the way things looked in the last five to ten years. And I ran across this. This is an interactive walkthrough called... Um, I believe it's called The Office or The Room or something like that, but it's by um, these developers that I have never heard of before, and they are called Nuts Nuts. You can see that on screen. Um, and this is really, really awesome. They are using the Unreal Engine 4, and I am just blown away by the technology and blown away by how well things can look in Unreal Engine 4. And this is the future of gaming. I mean, this is it. This will eventually uh, transfer over into our niche of gaming. It will eventually make its way over to sim racing and all that good stuff. And it is really awesome. So I wanted to just do... I just wanted to walk you through this and showcase the immense detail in the Unreal Engine 4. And uh, so we're just going to kind of walk around here, guys, and just, just check this out. I mean, I'm just going to make a loop around the room and just pay attention to the detail in the lighting. Um, this is literally photorealistic. Um, in the field that I'm in, uh, I draw maps and then I draw uh, 3D house plans for people and things like that. And a few years ago... This was not even possible for what I did. Uh, I would render a house, a 3D house, and I would have to render that image to make it photorealistic. And it was something that even with the best technology from a couple of years ago, um, would take like nearly an hour to render one angle, one image that looked like this. And now with the Unreal Engine 4, You've got games and interactive playgrounds, I would call them, like this, where it's literally rendering these photorealistic images in real time with no real issue, looking around really quickly like I'm doing now. This is insane. This is the future of gaming. Look, look at all the detail and the actual the texture that this picture, this is obviously an image of Will Smith. It's a drawing of Will Smith. But I'm not really interested in the drawing itself. I'm interested in the texture on, on the canvas that the picture is drawn on. That looks so realistic. Um, and now I know you guys are losing some of this. Uh, you're losing some of this because you're, it, it got processed through my uh, processing software. And then you lose a little bit of it through YouTube. But... It is insanity. Check out the lighting effects when I turn this light on. I mean, that's crazy. This is just unreal, the way the shadows cast on the floor. Um, look at that. Something as simple as that ceiling fan just looks so detailed. Look at the rafters on the roof. I mean, it's crazy. The other thing I want to do is I want to walk up to this wall. This is a You would think nothing in this corner back here. There's nothing special. But let's walk up to the wall. And just look at the detail on the wall. You literally can see the texture of the paint. And that is just something you do not get at all in games. You lose that. When you walk so close up to something like this pole, for example, you typically lose all that texture. But the Unreal Engine 4 allows you to walk right up to something and get all the detail, all the reflections. I mean, that is just... It's insane, guys. I was literally blown away with this. And we have some games available right now that are very, very graphic intensive. And you can, you can see some really amazing stuff. But nothing to this level that I know of. One thing I wanted to show you was check this out. Look, you can see the texture in this gray couch, right? Um, and dark gray colors, black colors and stuff. A lot of times you can see textures in them and the textures don't go away. 
But watch this is interactive. I can change this to a white couch. Here's the thing. I changed it to a white couch. Typically white, the color white, bleeds out any, any texture and any detail. But I've changed this couch to white and you still see all the texture and all the detail in this couch. I, I mean, I don't know what you guys think about this, but this is insanity to me. To have a, a live, moving game or interactive thing like this, whatever you want to call this, that moves in real time and creates these photorealistic images is just insane. Look at this. Look at the textures on this little bean bag. You know, that's not just a blob of pink and black. That's literally textured. You know, that mesh texture that, that that would actually be made of. It looks like it's crinkled where people have been sitting on it. I mean, this is just crazy. Look at the details in the canvas that that is drawn on. Just crazy, guys. I mean, I'm, I'm literally blown away with this. Look at the back of that chair. I mean, look at the textures on the table. Just absolutely crazy. And the lighting effects and the shadows. The, the way the light... Let me walk over here and show you this. Look at how the light comes through the window and hits that table. I mean, you can actually see that better if I shut these little lights off. So let's shut that off there. Let's walk over here and shut this one off. Just awesome. Just look at how the lighting changes. Look at all the details on this stuff on the shelf over here. Freaking insanity. Just, there's, a, there's another one of these pictures. That's Johnny Depp. But again, you can see the texture in the, in the mesh that's used to create what that's actually drawn on top of. But oh yeah, let me walk over here again. Here we go. Let me, let me try to get that same angle where that light was coming through the room. Yeah, I mean, just look at how that, look how it hits the table. So awesome. This is awesome to me. To me, guys, this is the future of gaming. So props to the folks who created this. I think they have a few others. I'm going to look into finding the other ones they have to. Um, but this is the one that intrigued me the most because this is just a simple walkthrough environment and, and the level of detail is just insanity. Look at that flare. Look at that light flare. This is photorealistic, guys. I, I, the amount of technology, the, the programming that is involved to make this work in the first place is amazing. But then to get this to work with a fairly decent performing machine, like I don't even have that crazy of a uh, graphics card. I just have a 980 Ti and I have a fairly basic i5 processor, but still I'm able to move around smoothly all while capturing with OBS. So anyways, guys, I'm gonna put a link in the description to these guys. You can go uh, to the link and you can try this out for yourself because surely through YouTube and through me processing the video, you have lost some of the detail. The only way you'll actually see the detail yourself is by downloading this and trying this out. Just do this little walkthrough, uh, play with the things that they'll allow you to change, you know, the colors of couches, turn the lights on and off because it's truly, absolutely amazing. This is, look, just look at the texture of the floor. That looks real, that's photorealistic. That is amazing to accomplish through a gaming system. Unreal Engine 4 is just absolutely amazing. It makes every other game I've ever played look like trash literally and i'm really excited about where the future of gaming is going this is really awesome so like i said guys um very cool uh, very awesome to the devs for creating this to let us try it is free to try i'll put the link in the description below so you can check it out yourself thanks so much for watching guys i hope you are ex as excited as i am about the future of gaming because in the next five years i'd say it's just everything's going to look so real um, it's just going to look so real and the technology of virtual reality is just going to get better and I'm really excited about gaming. So thanks so much for watching guys. Click that like button if you enjoyed and I will talk to you in the next video.